everyone welcome to my channel gram tree today we'll be discussing the topic parts of speech parts of speech are the different types of words that each have a special job in a sentence like naming things showing action or connecting ideas all words in english belong to a word class called the parts of speech there are eight basic parts of speech in english each with a unique function now let's see the parts of speech there are eight basic parts of speech in english noun pronoun verb adjective adverb preposition conjunction and interjection now let's check what is noun a noun represents a person, place, animal, thing, or idea. Noun are the subjects or objects in a sentence. For examples, dog, school, happiness, etc. Let's check in sentence now. The dog is barking. In this sentence, the word dog is a noun, as it is the name of an animal. Now let's check what are pronouns. A pronoun replaces a noun to avoid repetition. Pronouns refer to a noun mentioned earlier or assumed by a context. For example, I, he, she, it, we, they, you, etc. Now let's look at a sentence. She is reading a book. Here she is a pronoun as it replaces the noun. Now let's check the third part of speech, verbs. A verb expresses action, occurrence or a state of being. Verbs describe what the subject does or what happens to it. For examples, run. Think, writing, etc. Now let's check a sentence. He runs every morning. Here, the word run is the verb and it expresses an action. Now let's check what are adjectives. An adjective describes or modifies a noun. Adjectives provide more information about the noun, such as its appearance or quantity. For examples, red, tall, three. Now let's check its sentence. She wore a red dress. He, in the sentence, the word red describes more about the dress. Now let's check the fifth part of speech, adverbs. An adverb modifies a verb, adjective, or another adverb. Adverbs tell how, when, where, or to what extent something happens. For examples, quickly, sadly, always, early, now, here, there, well, loudly, suddenly, quietly, etc. Now let's check a sentence. He ran quickly. In this sentence, the word quickly modifies the verb ran. Now let's check what are prepositions. A preposition shows the relationship between a noun or pronoun and other words in a sentence. Preposition indicate direction, time, location or a relationship. For examples, on, in, next to or beside, in front of, behind, between, under, through, around, etc. Now let's check a sentence. The book is on the table. The word on describes where the book is. So it's a preposition. Now let's check what are conjunctions. A conjunction connects words, phrases or clauses. Conjunctions join ideas or sentences together. For examples, 
yet, so, but, or, because, nor, and, for, etc. Now let's check a sentence. I wanted to go, but it started raining. In this sentence, but is the conjunction because it joins two sentences. Now let's check the final part of speech, interjection. An interjection is a word or phrase that expresses strong emotion or sudden reaction. It stands alone to express feeling and is often followed by an exclamation mark. For examples, Wow! Good grief! Hey! Ouch! Hooray! Oh! Oops! Oh no! Etc. Now let's check a sentence. Wow, that's amazing. In this sentence, wow is an interjunction. Hope you understood all parts of speech. That is noun, pronoun, verb, adjective, adverb, preposition, conjunction, interjection. Shall we try an activity now? Identify the parts of speech. The cats are sleeping. In the sentence, the cats are noun. This cake is delicious. In this sentence, delicious is an adjective. They danced happily at the party. In this sentence, happily is an adverb. She went to the store. In this sentence, she is a pronoun. He runs every morning. In this sentence, runs is a verb. The cat is under the table. In this sentence, under is a preposition. I wanted to go, but I was too tired. In this sentence, but is a conjunction. Oh no, I forgot my homework. In this sentence, oh no is an interjunction. Now let's check more examples with more parts of speech in a sentence. The happy boy quickly ran to the park. In this sentence, happy is an adjective. Quickly is an adverb. Ran is a verb. To is a preposition. Oh, they are working because it's important. In this sentence, O oh, is an interjection. They is a pronoun. Working is a verb. Because is a conjunction. Now let's see a sentence with all parts of speech. Wow, the dog quickly ran under the big tree because he was scared. In this sentence, wow is an interjunction. Dog is a noun. Quickly is an adverb. Ran is a verb. Under is a preposition. Big is an adjective. Because is a conjunction. He is a pronoun. So here we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and ring the notification bell. Please like, comment, share. See you all in my next video. Bye-bye.